this is going to be a tutorial on how to get San Andreas multiplayer on the Steam version of San Andreas. So the first thing you want to do is maybe you have San Andreas installed on your Steam. And then what you want to do is you want to go to your Steam folder, go to Steam Apps, Common, and then you want to find, and you see this folder, the Grand Theft Auto San Andreas folder. Well, you want to open that, select everything except the GTSA test app, and install script. Then you want to copy it, and you want to want to go to another folder. I have one made here, and then you paste everything in it. And I'm gonna pause the video and put put it back when this is done. All right, so now that's done, and I actually just realized that you don't need the same folder because you probably don't have it yet. I don't know. It was there. Yeah, you don't you don't need this here. Yeah. Sorry about that. That's the folder I have it installed in. So, yeah. Okay. Um. So now what you want to do is you want to click one of the download the media fire link in the description, and you want to download this GTA SA X, and it'll take a few seconds, but it should be fairly quick. Now this is just a different version of the GTASA.ex that you would find in the Steam folder, um, but you can't use this one in the Steam folder because it's you can only run it through Steam because otherwise you could just send people all the files. See, Norton says it's safe, so it's not a virus or anything. Um, so yeah, you put that in there. Then you want to go to samp.sa-mp.com. Click downloads, and then I like to use the one by the Samp team, but like if you play on any of these servers, you could use that one of those, I guess. I don't know. I just use this one. So you download the install. So yeah, basically um, about the GTSA file, uh, Steam won't let you launch it outside of Steam. Otherwise, uh, you could just send your friends your files, and they can play it for free without buying it. Um, but if I that me. Uh, giving this download, uh, you can't play it off of that. So if I just run this, it won't do anything. Yeah. See, it says it kind of missed these files. So, but I mean, I guess if you somehow find all those files from somewhere else, you could play it. Um, so then you want to move this into the GTA folder as well. Uh, actually, you don't have to, but I like to do it anyway. So yes, I agree. Then you want to click browse and find the folder where you keep, where you have the thing, and then see that the, this is the GTA folder that's right here, it doesn't show the sa.ex file, but it's theirs, and now you can click OK, and you click install, click finish, and that's done. So now you have SAMP, and you have servers that I had before, and you can connect to any server you want. Down. Oh, this one's down. Oh. So yeah, uh, that's it, and goodbye.